Lovely. Yeah. As you can see, this is the yacht on our Lennon Centre. Obviously, John Lennon's wife is Liverpool's hometown of the Beatles. So we're going into the city centre right now, and as you can see, the houses are beautifully arranged and really nicely. Um, look at Oh my gosh! Oh. I've never seen that so big. Here in Liverpool, there's a lot of range of different kinds of um, places, like you've got Italian restaurants, Chinese restaurants. There was even an American staycation place. The city is very cosmopolitan, so you can see we have a, what I believe it to be a German pub right behind me. Liverpool is really similar to Dublin, look at it. Literally all the pubs and everything. You've even got the Irish flags. Okay. This city is all about music because of course the Beatles and also about football mainly because of Liverpool and C and Everton. Yeah, this is popular here because Dublin isn't actually that far away. Goodness. the cabin wall of fame uh, <laughs> so to celebrate opening of cabin club 14th okay. anniversary and all these musicians such as Elton John, Judas Priest, um, <laughs> Queen and T. The architecture is very similar to the tree, but it puts the tree in the This is a museum. Very big museum. Theatre is absolutely humongous. Really lovely scenery here. Yeah. They didn't get a lot bigger in real life. Oh my days! Wow. <gasps> How did so you park cool. Oh my god, you can see the seats from here! My question That's is, crazy. my question is, how do 60,000 people park? Where do they park? That's very Blemons, I think. We're officially here, look at that beautiful sign. Yeah. So this is the stadium up close. Really big.
Goodington Park, right over there. Stadium of Everton. So this is the canteen where all the football players at Liverpool FC eat. Got a buffet and a fish Right now we're right next to the River Mercy. Lovely scenery as you can see. So right now we're on a um, tour bar. We're going to be going around Liverpool, seeing some of the uh, monuments and statues of Liverpool. As you can see in the map where we'll be going. Yeah, that's in the map. St. Patrick's Day, and also David's birthday. Yeah, that is true. Sweet 16. That is true, wow.
Partly off. Under Paul McCartney's house. Childhood house. Childhood house, yes. Um, we can't really go over because we haven't booked a place or anything, but we can still mile up on our side. As you can see in the corner, it says the property of National Trust. So I don't think anyone lives there. I think they just own it. But it does say that you, there's no direct access inside the house, so you never know.